I am finally getting surgery and uh, this is like, this is like, this is such an amazing thing for me because I have really big breasts and um, I'm finally getting a breast reduction and I'm leaving for Miami literally in a few hours. Hey, how are you? How's it going, man? Well, yeah, very nice to meet you. Bro? You ready? I'm ready, bro. Here we go. Let's All do right, it. Very good. Who that is? Who is it? Hello? Oh, shit! Why y'all didn't tell me y'all was coming? Hey, y'all! You know, the edge of the slate and like, girl. How y'all doing? What's up? We in Miami? It's beautiful. It's sunny. And guys, I got, I'm trying to give a lot of... Oh, goddamn, I'm glistening. Am I sweating? Oh, that's my lotion. Okay, so I'm glistening. I'm shining, as y'all can see. Me my Miami, you know what I'm saying? And today's the day, y'all. Like, I'm trying to give out positive energy and just have high vibrations. But I'm going to meet my doctor today. Like I said, I'm nervous about this. Y'all know why I'm out here in Miami. Y'all gonna see the boobs. Y'all gonna see the full, up close, and personal, how big these things are. And he's gonna tell me what size we're gonna get them to. But make sure you guys like subscribe right now if you guys aren't subscribed and spam this video y'all wish me luck wish me luck <laughs> if y'all ain't seen on easy x natty by now nat nat is with me um you know my baby she here to support me um what do you feel like about my surgery baby like i'm so excited for you i know you've wanted this for a long time and the thought that you're finally like going through with it and stuff like that and i know this is like a big yeah. thing for you so i'm just really excited so crazy y'all like i was saying in my other video that natalie is the reason why like i'm actually getting it she's the one that persuaded me to get it because i was you know like i said to you guys before that i was trying to wait and hold off until you know i had kids and stuff like that but because my baby was just like live for you and don't be you ha you can be selfish you're gonna get it done anyway you might as well get it while you are in your prime like you don't know when you're gonna have kids and you just like tomorrow tomorrow what? <laughs> what? 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 and have have fun while you while while you can right now where you don't have kids and you don't yeah. have you know what i'm saying yeah tell them what you said tell them what you said before we got a car up on my head oh, i said you got a big ass head do i got a big ass head i think natalie's head is way bigger than mine y'all look at her head Y'all should see it from the back, like her. What? Head. Hold the, hold, hold them. This is what I saw when I was walking behind her. What's wrong? <laughs> it ain't big. What are you talking about? I was like, damn, you got a big ass head. You <laughs> Oh my goodness. Baby, he gonna be feeling on my titties. I know, girl. He how gonna you be gonna like, be doing that? How he gonna be, do it? He, no, he gonna be like, okay, so <gasps> I think <gasps> so you could, I know, I know. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. No. He gonna be, he gonna be like, yo, like, all right, okay. Uh-uh. Okay. I ain't never really had a man touching my boobs for in a long time. I was gonna say, don't lie to them. No, in a long time. It's uh, been a long time. It's been a long time. Not at this left side. Left oh. Left oh. Uh. Oh, get a, get a good. Y'all can't really see the boobs. Y'all gonna see it in there, but when I wear black, you can't really see the boobs. Show, like just, the, just show them a little sneaky peeky. Oh. Did you get my gut? I don't know. Baby. I heard you didn't warn me. I didn't know. Oh. Right, I know we got a lot of here we go videos, but here we go. Just thought of something. What? You know how you always be like, my titties are sweating. That's where your famous line. My titties are sweating. You yeah, you, you know my no more. Wait, do you think they still gonna sweat? That's nice. No? Not as much. Not as much because you think they'll sweat. Be, I mean, they do, but not that much. Yeah, because you be talking about it all the time. <laughs> you know my titties be sweating. They hot. They sweat. <laughs> that's so, wow. R.I.P. to that saying. Damn. We gotta do. Y'all gotta make a, a R.I.P. video like all the moments I talked about my boobs, all the moments that I've like shown them. You know what I'm saying? So, there's so <laughs> many moments, so yeah. this should not be hard to buy. Yeah. Okay. So do that for me right now. Look at these titties. Should I get more titties? So I get more titties than little titty. That's a little implant. Right there. Hold on. Look at that one. That's a big implant right now. That's a big titty. That's my titty right now. Right now. That's my titty. This you is my titty. Two or three yeah. of these in there, not one. <laughs> <laughs> you right. You right, baby. I'm gonna put that down. Put that titty right there. That's a titty. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, how How's are you? How's it going, man? Well, yeah, very nice to meet you. Bro? How are you? What's up, man? I'm doing good. I'm excited. You're excited? Yeah, yeah. I'm nervous, excited. Excited, yeah. nervous. That's normal. I 
I'm here with Easy. She's coming from the West Coast all the way to Miami. We're gonna be talking about a breast reduction. Yep. Full um, disclosure, I've already seen Easy. We've already had like a formal con uh, consultation. We've mm -hmm. talked about everything. We're gonna kind of just review things again. Right. Just to kind of go through things. So it's happening. It's happening. Okay. You. It's, you. Excited. You. <laughs> I need them gone. Take them off, Doc. Let's go. Okay. So. Tell, tell me what, what you're interested in and just disclose whatever you feel like disclose. Right. I don't want to make it too personal, obviously. But. So pretty much, I literally just want a breast reduction my entire life. Well, not my entire life, but after high school, they just was like big, big, you know? And then my, my posture just went from this to this, you know what I'm saying? I'm just like, dang, my neck, my back, everything, my crack, everything. <laughs> but it was literally just uh, a lot of pressure. And I actually got x-rays and my spine is kind of messed up because of my hunchback. So I'm just like, yo, my mom went through it, um, having big breasts, my aunts, everybody. So it's time for me to do it. I'm just like, it's genetic. I need a, I need a reduction. You know, these need to be little, little small, tiny. Mm -hmm. anyway, as small as you can get. So, I mean, that's, that's basically, you've said everything that I've heard, like, yeah. literally hundreds of times. Mm -hmm. Patients with large breasts, yeah. it's a genetic thing. The breasts start out, they're, they're just genetically made wide. Yeah. So they get big, they get heavy, and then they cause all the problems. I don't know if they cause problems with the crack, but usually, <laughs> usually it's problems with the neck and the yeah. back. Uh, patients are, you know, can't exercise, they have a difficult time yeah. finding clothes. And I'm like, you know, jumping, it's like my boobs, one boob's going this way, the boob's going that way. I'm just like, <laughs> trying to jump rope, you know what I'm saying? Like, or when I'm sleeping, it's just, it's a lot, it's a lot of movement going on, you know? So, we're going to do a breast reduction, um, which, uh, you know, making her breast smaller. And it's a big scar, it's, a, it's all the way around the areola, down underneath, and then it's an anchor pattern. And so I like to be really forthright and upfront with how long the scar is because I have to make the scar as wide as the breast is. I got some wide boobs. And so yeah, that's why wide. your breasts are big. That's why you're here. If you had a narrow breast, you wouldn't have like a big heavy breast. You yeah. would have a saggy breast maybe, but not, you know, something that was really bothering you its way. So yeah. it's a, it's a uh, anchor pattern scar. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make your breast. She really, you really want to go small. Yeah. I'm going to make you as small as I can. As I mentioned, I have to mm -hmm. leave some volume there to be able to get the best shape. So yeah. patients like easy are very easy for me because you know they want to be small, <laughs> small, small, small. Yeah. So for me, it actually makes my job simpler because mm -hmm. what I do is I make your breasts as small as I can. Yeah but I have to keep a little bit of tissue behind in order to, number one, preserve the blood supply, mm -hmm. right, that we talked about to the nipple and the areola, so I have to have a certain width of that breast there. Yep. And then um, we have to leave enough volume to have a shape. Keep cute. Keep cute. Keep it cute. We, yeah. keep it cute. We, don't, keep it cute. we don't want to go from, you know, 100 to zero. Yeah. Right. Um, so, and usually when I do that, it, mm -hmm. patients are usually happy. We kind of get like a nice, happy medium where you get something that's much more livable for you. It's more manageable. Right. It feels better. They're not going to be cockeyed. Relieves. Really. Yeah. No, they're not going to be cockeyed. <laughs> you are going to have one a little bit higher than the other. Remember, we talked about that. Yeah, I got my, one of my, It's because one of my boobs are literally, you know, that's everybody's boobs. It's they're normal. not perfect. Yeah, it's normal. Mm. Totally normal. Nobody has perfect. I get two patients a year mm -hmm. that have perfectly symmetrical breasts. Wow. And I put implants in them and they go straight to Instagram. Dang! <laughs> just like that. <laughs> because they have perfect breasts, but yeah. it's just in the reality. Like, get those ones. <laughs> it's yeah. In reality, it's not. I mean, nobody has breasts that are exactly the same height. Yeah. The same position. The same width. You know, some right. are longer. We talked about all that stuff. You have normal asymmetry. Yeah. Okay. And so you're going to be normally asymmetric after surgery. Right. There's nothing I can do that's going to move one breast higher or lower. Okay. Just like I can't move one of your ears up or down yeah and it's just the way it is if we start looking at all of us mm -hmm. you know and starts measuring like oh this to that so we're all oh, you'd be like oh I didn't know my left ear was this. I didn't know my eye was right. like this I didn't know one of my lips was like this my hands my knees my feet whatever you have two of yeah. there's always gonna be some asymmetry but yours is normal totally yeah. normal asymmetry so normal. so wait I have a question can I show them like just my what I look like in a bra or no 
It's up to you. Whatever yeah. you feel. Just so you guys can whatever know. Whatever you feel comfortable yeah. with is totally up to yeah, you. Yeah, I don't mind. Just so you guys can get that visual of like, all right, went from this to that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so let's look. I'll show y'all. I'm not going to. Don't look at my gut too much. Don't focus on the guts. Let me pull on my drawers. Now we're not working with tomorrow. We're, more, we're not working with what? With your gut. You said. No. No, just not the boobs. gut. Just the boobs. Just I know. <laughs> just the boobs. So yeah. <laughs> all right. So this is the before. Remember these. They would be no longer. <laughs> you are retarded. All right. The double D's. Let me. Can you, can you see? Can you see, Sid? Can you see, my boy? Can you see? I'm asking you, bro. Can you see? He's like, I'm not talking. He's like, I'm just the camera guy. Yeah. All right. Get the side. I'm in your befores here. <laughs> right. He's just like, nice. <laughs> well, yeah. That's so you guys can get it like a real up close person. You ready? I'm ready, bro. Here we go. Let's oh, do it. Very good.